Hello, let me introduce you this awesome project, this flashlight watch. It looks great. This is tool for real men. It have many functions, switches and potentiometers. And it is my most useful project. When I need to find something very important in dark, I always have my flashlight watch. Ok, I'm just kidding. I created this for my young students. Kids love this kind of stuff. I created this so kids can learn about basic electronic components like LEDs, switches and potentiometers. Believe me, they are very proud when they build their flashlight watch by themselves. They can decide how much light they want by turning on or off individual LEDs and adjusting brightness with pot. If you like this project, stay tuned, because I will explain how to get these PCBs and how to make this project with your... so you can make this with your kit. Also, feel free to subscribe for more awesome projects. So, let's start. Boards are produced by PCB Way. Uh, here is package and inside this nice cardboard box I find that those. I ordered uh, three different PCB, uh, 10 of each. Red PCB is used only as bottom part of watch flashlight and it will be used to hold strap. Blue one is um, without potentiometer so it will not be used in this video. For the first time I decided to try try white PCB and I like it very much. Quality is great like always and components will look great on white PCB. I will share this project on PCB Wayside so you can order it easily. Ok, let's build this great project. Stay tuned to see all parts. First part is this switch. It can be used to turn on or off all LEDs on board. Next one is this 4 bit uh, dip switch. With uh, that part your little explorer can control each LED. LED. Here is potentiometer. You can uh, use any 10k potentiometer. I decided to use this one because it is easy to use. I don't need to use screwdriver. Here is battery holder for standard 3 volt coin battery, same battery that is used on motherboards for example. I will insert one battery uh, and now it's time to solder LEDs. I need to use same color LEDs because different colors can have a different forward voltages. Ok, ok, here it is, let's test it. It works very nice, I will try each LED and all of them works great. And on the back of board I will solder one more battery holder, now uh, I have double capacity of battery. Now it's time to make strap.
Here it is. I created uh, this project with my little students and they love it. I hope you like this project also. Feel free to check more interesting projects on my channel. Thank you and have a nice day. And I know I sound weird, I'm a little bit sick. And my English is still bad. Thank you. Bye.